All right, so here we go. The weight and the height gives one the action right here on one side. Maybe the division's most well-rounded fighter taking on arguably the biggest submission threat in this league. Because he's such a great submission grappler, I believe that this is the most dangerous fight for him in the division. Wow. He needs to maintain his space, stay away from this guy at all costs, and force him to stand up with him. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. That kick blocked by Lee. His hands are down. Let's set up that high kick now. Lance with the lead right. Try to establish that jab. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. That's a big hook. Oh, straight right. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Punch his block. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Big call for punch land. Now he gets back to range. And both guys really throwing with authority. Two minutes now to go in the opening round. Straight right hand, no good. Big punch land over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Trying to establish that jab once again. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, nice. Oh, big left. Oh. Head kick. Well, he's certainly keeping busy, DC, connecting with most of the punches he's doing. I mean, punches and punches. He's doing a great job. All right, there's the horn, and what a round it was. DC, take us through the replays. Punch after punch. He landed him at will. He went right at his opponent, got in his face, and showed, this is my octagon. We are going to dance to the beat of my two. All right, next round is underway, and I think my biggest takeaway in the previous round, his ability to avoid shots, right? It seemed like every time his opponent loaded up, by the time the strike got there, he was out of harm's way. And it was a very minimal movement. It wasn't a big movement off the center line. The opponent threw, it was maybe two inches off to the right that allowed him to be out of position from his opponent's punch, but still in position to return a strike of his own. Lee gets touched by that kick there. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target there. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Over and over, he landed these big body kicks. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Amir Khani. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. Right punches there. Just unable to quite find that range. 
visibly limping here. Well, that'll quiet the storm. Shot blocked by Amir Khani. You don't know when that leg keeps coming. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh! Oh! Right out of the elbow, right on the bottom. It was a perfectly placed shot, and you see his opponent reacting violently from that punch. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Punch coming, it's blocked. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg. Oh, strong punch there by Lee. Seconds left. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Oh, landing a punch with the left hand now, so certainly putting it all together on the feet tonight. Did a lot of work with his offhand. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. All right, next round is now underway. Previous round, not necessarily a tough act to follow. Pretty good round. Pretty good round, but not the best round. Sometimes that's what you get when you have fighters that are so evenly matched. Look at that leg. Again, making great use of his length in this matchup. Just misses with a left hook there. Nice kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that jet. Oh, misses with the jet. Punch over the top. Oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Straight right, he misses. Strong outside leg kick. Outside leg kick. Big leg kick lands. Oh, spinning back fist out of nowhere. Not there. Cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Trying to hammer that lead leg. You got the turn in that kick. Checks the leg kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Real nice body kick lands. Straight punch lands. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds.
A lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have the Telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my Telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. You ready? You ready? Let's go, fight! He blocks the punch. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. of your opponent with those leg kicks. Ooh, blocks the shot. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to move. Oh, oh. Back to the feet. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Watch the shot. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Punch lands over the top. Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt bad. Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Knee to the body. Oh, left hook to the head. It's blocked. stop his opponent right there in his tracks and it really takes strong technique to deliver a shot like that to maximize force over a short distance but man when guys do it right with those elbows it is absolutely devastating all right let's take a look back at the replay it ends up a knockout but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched i mean a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended 